Hello Divination and welcome. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to install and set up our free global preset style guide for Divi's fitness gym layout pack. This is the final result we're aiming to achieve. So without wasting a lot of time, let's dive in and let's get started. All right, so the first thing we need to do is to go to this article, which I'll link to in the show notes below. So this will have all our presets that we need for our website. All right, so I'm just going to scroll down here until I get to uh, this area here, which says get it for free today. So I'm going to click here and then add my email address. Click on download. All right, so next I need to click here on download the files. And now you can see it's downloading on my computer. Next, I need to come over here, navigate to that file in my folder. And then I need to unzip it. Okay, so I'm just going to bring it here so you can see it. Next, I'm going to double click it. So this unzips the folder, which is what we need to do here. And as you can see, this is just the one file. All right, so I'm just going to drag this over here to the side for a little bit. And then the next step now is to go to our website and install this preset. So I'm going to come over here, click on Divi, and then we want to go to our Divi library. This is the best way to import our presets. All right, so I'm just gonna delete this because I don't really need this right now. Next, I'm gonna come over here to import and export. So since we want to import the presets, I'm going to come over here and click on import. Next, I am going to choose the file, but notice that we also have this option which says import presets. So what happens is if I choose this, all the presets will be added automatically on our site. But what I'm going to do here is something a bit different. Okay, so I'm just going to drag this file over here, the one that we've just unzipped, and then I'm just going to click on Import DV Theme Builder Layout. So what this does now is every time I need to use a new module, then I'll have access to these presets. All right, so I'm going to go ahead now and import DV Builder Layout. All right, so um, what we need to do next is to... Um, Head over here so I can show you where to change your colors if you need to change them. And that is to come over here to theme options. So over here on theme options, this is our color palette. So if you want to uh, adjust your colors and change them around, all you have to do is to come over here and then you want to add your hexadecimal value here for your color or you can just use this color picker like that. Okay, so this is how you change your colors. All right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to go to a page and uh, start to see how these presets work. So I'm going to click here on Add New, and I'm just going to call this Presets. Use Diffie Builder. Next, I'm going to come over here and click on Choose a Pre-Made Layout. And I'm going to come over here to your Saved Layouts. So over here on my Saved Layouts, you can see we have this Fitness Gym Preset Style Guide Layout. So if I click on that, this is now going to load. So what I'm going to do now is to load this and see all the presets that we have. All right, so now that our presets has been loaded, let's go through and see what we have in here. So first of all, this is our color palette. So these are the colors you want to use with this layout. Okay, so we also have uh, things like the images. So you can see here we have uh, different styles of images. Um, we also have uh, all this. Now, all these images are going to be loaded into your media library. Now, here are the heading options. So we have heading one, heading two, heading three, and so on. So when it's time now to design your website, you are going to have all this accessible to you, which means your whole website is going to be consistent. And this is why these uh, presets are very, very important. All right, so let's dive in now and let's take a look and see how this uh, would work in real life if you wanted to work on this gym layout pack. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to um, open a brand new page. So we're going to go to our dashboard here and over here, I'm just going to exit the visual builder. So over here, let's uh, go ahead and create a new page one more time. Uh, we're going to call this new page, use the Divi Builder. Right, so I'm going to come over here to our pre-made layout and search for fitness. So the layout pack we're looking at is um, this one right here. So I'm going to go with that. 
then I'm going to use this layout. So you may be asking, why am I going with a pre-made layout? I could, be, I could have just built everything from scratch. Now, this is because most of the layout that we need is already there in our pre-made layout. So it just makes things easier for us to go in and um, start using a design that has already been done. But it doesn't mean that we cannot create our elements of our page from scratch. Okay, so now that we have this, let's see if our presets now is going to work. So I'm going to click here on this plus button. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a button. I'm going to select this. Okay. So now that we have this button here, you can see it's right here. If I click on this drop down, now you're going to see our preset. So this is a F -L -F -A -L -P button one. So if I go ahead and select that, you can see automatically our button here has changed. Now let's go to uh, the second style. And again, you can see here that the style is changing. And that is because we have preloaded our presets in here. Now, one really cool thing that you can also do is uh, with this selected, you can actually go into this design and make a few changes. So let's say you were going to change the spacing a little bit like that. And uh, we can also do a little bit here. So now with those changes done, if you click on this drop down, you can create a brand new preset on the settings that I've just done right now. And this will be added onto this list. So as you can see, this is very, very powerful and uh, presets are really, really cool to use. They save you a lot of time and uh, you can design your pages even faster. All right, so let's do one more example and uh, that is uh, adding a blurb. So let's add one uh, right here. So I'm gonna choose blurb like that. So there we go. So you can see here that it has no design whatsoever on it. So now if I come over here to my default, we have all these different styles. So if I choose this one here, you can see that has changed. Blurb four. Okay. So you can cycle through these and choose the one you want. In fact, you know what? I really like this one. So let's say you want to add an icon. So what you would do is to come over here to image an icon, select icon, and then this is where you get to choose your icon. So let's go with this one here. So as you can see, our icon here has been added and I can then now go to my design, image an icon, and I can play around with the size by just changing it over here, just like that, okay? But as you can see, all our elements are added already. Okay, so let's go ahead and delete this. So as you can see, the presets are handy when designing your web pages. So in this case, as I mentioned before, I've chosen to use this pre-made layout because this has pretty much all the colors, the layouts of my design. So all I have to do, if I need to add any elements, all these come from my global presets. So there you have it. Thank you all for watching. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up and do follow us on our social media platforms. By doing so, you'll be notified when we release new tutorials. Until next time, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.